there. My name is Rachel Evans and um, I'm here in Florence in Italy on Thursday the 4th of August um, and I've just decided to record a video to show how you can pack for a short trip and take hand luggage on your aeroplane. Um, I've packed for four nights and staying in the Hotel degli Orofi in Florence right near the River Arno. Um, it's a four-star hotel, very nice. I paid a reasonable amount of money, um, a good deal through booking.com and uh, I'm very happy. It's a small room, really compact, perfect just for sleeping here because I'll be going out a lot. I met my friend Tiziana, my Italian friend who lives in Florence and she picked me up from Pisa Airport. So while I'm waiting for her, because it's about 6.30 in the evening, um, I'm waiting uh, for her to come back and then we're going to go out for dinner. So now I've just packed everything. I'll show you the luggage that I had. So I came with this hand luggage, which is within the regulations and the EasyJet um, size, and I had one little tiny handbag. So this bag went in there, and I did have to use the extension for my packing. As you can see, it's a really, as you can see, it's a small suitcase. So in this suitcase, I fit it in. I'm just going to move it here. I had to put the bag into the suitcase. So with the um, regulation size um, hand luggage, I actually packed for four days and four nights. The clothes that I'm wearing are some white jeans, my trainers for comfort with socks because it's very hot, it's August, a lightweight summer cardigan and a Hollister t-shirt. I'm wearing a pink bra and we'll come to underwear later. So I'm going to go through my packing and show you what I've got. I've just unpacked it. So here at the Hotel Delhi Orofi, I packed very compact amount of clothes. I've got this jacket. I've got an Uniglo cagoule which folds up and a very lightweight bright yellow uh, cardigan. I'm going to bring the camera a little bit further in so you can see everything. But this is what I'm wearing to travel in. White jeans, my belt, uh, it's got metal so obviously to have got for security or I'll go bleep bleep. Um, so I'll probably wear these on the way back, I'll take them off because I've only worn them for half a day. If I was at home I'd just throw them in the wash but I don't have that facility here. Um, so I'm going to show you what I packed for four days and four nights. So if you just follow me in the room, here's the thing wardrobe, leather jacket, cagoule, cardigan. As you can see, I've got shoes on the floor and I'll show you everything. I've got three, whoops, I've got my t-shirts, cotton, Hollister, a coral, an orange colour and a green. Then I've got a shrug which is great, they screw up these ones. Two white tops, Hollister shirt, this is my evening dress with the zip, that one, um, cocktail, another easy fold away um, coral river island, um, what's it called, yeah, river island uh, top, two hoodies made of sequins from pineapple, and my white jeans, straight jeans, and the short, shorter jeans. The shoes I've got are flip flops and some dancing shoes with um, some crystals, Swarovski crystals. My jewellery is a head candy necklace, my Thomas Sabo rings and um, my Armani watch. Then I've got some Thomas Sabo bracelet and um, these are the accessories that I travel with, just some black cuffs as you can see. I've got a pin on brooch to add some fancy colour to something if I needed it, if I was wearing black and some hair pieces that I might wear just for fun. And then, of course, I'll show you my bikinis very quickly. So as you can see, there's not a lot in there. There's only a few pieces. And there's my bikinis from Hollister. I've got a pink one that I've worn in a photo shoot before. The Hollister ones. And then I've got some bra tops as well, which are very light. And these can actually be worn 
as um, running tops and there's a bandeau for the beach so they can be worn on to give a pop of color underneath your black dress like I have over here which I'm wearing tonight it's a little black dress as you can see and um, it rolls up beautifully something else I think is great as a silk scarf it rolls up beautifully so if we go back to the clothes you can see that my little tops are going to serve me very well indeed and there's the other bra in the safe I've got things like my camera chargers um, documents and bags and stuff in here I've got a little beanie hat to wear if I'm drying my hair at night sleeping in my braids I've got a sun hat which is really quite cool I'll show you what that looks like now so if you look in that you can see me with my sun hat on it's quite cool actually I like it very nice little hat what you reckon cool yeah I like that okay so that's going to go in the beach bag when I go to the beach so you've got your sun hat there I've got pashmina again it rolls up a little um, turban hair thing for the beach or washing my hair here it rolls up um, two lycra shorts for running or wear under my black dress if um, it's short they roll up my knickers some g-strings yeah nice colors and my American apparel socks those ones are great with my pink shorts and I have some socks in there as well so basically all you need is to roll things up and I've even got a roll up bag which matches the cagoul which is great because it's so tiny let me go and show you now before we show you how to do stuff there is my bikinis and my tops coral and pink and these are the bottoms and I've got one pair of shorts which I'm, I'm trying to speedily do this because I don't want to use too much of my camera up I've just gone on the internet at the hotel and deleted some of the pictures I took earlier by accident because the hotel has got one um, internet um, and it's really weird so it played up you, you, you don't lay things out when you pack in like that you roll them like this like this and they take up a lot less room so those shorts are going to get rolled up nice and neat and they should go like that into your bag and I'm just going to put this here for a moment to show you how to pack your little black dress it's this one I don't know if you can see it's this one so what you do you fold it sideways like that and then you take it and you roll it like so and then you put it like that here together that's how you pack you roll them and as you can see it takes up a tiny that's my hand it takes up a tiny amount of space back to the wardrobe so they're my bikini bottoms which again I've bought an extra two because I might wear them in bed I actually quite like um, bringing extra pants I actually bikini bottoms to go with bikinis and in the bottom don't tell anyone I've got some food I've got some biscuits some fruits in case I get the munchies in the middle of the night I've got an extra pillow so just let me show you how much space you need to take up in your wardrobe when you're traveling for four days and four nights there you go voila how to pack for a four night trip to Italy three t-shirts two white tops one shirt that can double up as a little cardigan a cover up on the beach a pink dress two black hoodies one jacket for traveling on the airplane when it's cool two white trousers one is um, skinny jeans and the others um, knee shorts one pair of pink shorts and one pink cagoule and I think there's another um, three bandeau tops to wear um, on the beach under t-shirts for a pop of color or under black if you're wearing all black and I've got one pair of flip-flops one pair of sparkly Swarovski crystal shoes and some only a bit of jewelry take note there's only a little tiny bit of jewelry there and my bikinis of course so back to rolling things up there's the suitcase absolutely tiny there's the bag that I put in the suitcase and I'll take you now